here it says of a square root function basic find the domain of the function h of x equals the square root of x plus 5 and u of x equals the square root of x minus 6 okay now normally the domain is always negative infinity to infinity unless you have a fraction you have a square root and in later cases unless you have a logarithm but that's not till we get to college algebra for now if we have a fraction you know that the denominator cannot equal zero for a square root you know that the radicand must be greater than or equal to zero radicand is just a fancy word for inside the square root so in then in part a the inside of the square root is x plus 5, and that has to be greater than or equal to 0. And if I solve for x here, it means that x has to be greater than or equal to negative 5. And if I want to put my answer in interval notation, like it tells me to, that would mean here's negative 5 and everything greater would be this way. And because of this bar, it would be a bracket. So it would be bracket negative 5 to forever that way would be infinity. And that's the domain of interval notation. For part B, the only thing inside the radical, this 6, this minus 6 is not inside the radical. So if I take only what's inside the radical and set that greater than or equal to 0, I don't need to solve for x, it's already solved for. So if I graph that on a number line, that's from 0 and everything bigger, and because of the bar, it'll be a bracket. So the domain there would be zero to infinity.